So about the name, polycystic ovary syndrome is misnomer. The term polycystic refers to the appearance of multiple small, typically two, uh, nine millimeters antral follicles, arrested in development along the periphery of the ovary, often described as a string of pearls on ultrasound. They are not true cyst, fluid-filled sacs resulting from pathology, but rather immature follicles that fall to mature and ovulate due to underlying hormone imbalance. Furthermore, polycystic ovarian morphology is not required for diagnosis under the widely used Rotterdam criteria if the patient uh, has both hyperandrogenism and ovulatory, ovulatory dysfunction. Why it's so important? Understanding the distinction is vital for accurate patient communication. Okay?